Hey, what's up, y'all? Welcome to the channel. Brian the Divine here, right here with you. Glad to bust a move on your tarot card reading. All right. How you doing? You doing well? I think we're doing uh, Capricorn Aquarius. Capricorn Aquarius, welcome, welcome. Come on in. We're not ready yet. Put your feet up, relax. Let's get into your reading, okay? Let me shut these cards up a couple more times, and then we'll get into your message. All right, that's one. Let's get to the second one here. All right. Feeling some pretty good energy, all right? Let's just see what comes out. All right, let's do it. First card out. It's going to be this. Justice. Mm, pretty self-explanatory. Justice is justice. All right, I don't really call signs, but I think we know what that is. Let's get your other card here, and then we'll get to your store. Hermit. All right. So it's like you're seeking wisdom. You're seeking um, justice, but in a wise way. Okay, because the hermit's wise, and you have two majors, so that's pretty huge. Two majors for your energy right off the bat. That's pretty big. All right. So we're going to get into your story now. Let's uh, work this all out and see what, what kind of message this is going to tell you. Mm. Investment. Oh, look at you. I mean, there's a sacrifice here. So maybe you do have to make a sacrifice for this kind of investment, right? And maybe this is what you're analyzing in your journey here with the Hermit card. We're going to get it. Let's go get it and find out. Oh, judgment. So I feel here that you're kind of done with losing things, right? You're, you know, I mean, you're not really bothered by it that much, but it's like you're calling judgment on sacrificing things. Okay, so maybe now it's, it's like, um, it's not that you're losing because you have a whole lot of pentacles right here, right? But it's just this one that you're losing, sacrificing, right? So. It's like you're weighing your pros and cons, okay? Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. You're trying to weigh your pros and cons about something, you know? See, and you're going to be happy about that, right? So whatever you, that you're investing in, you know that... Sometimes you, you do lose a little bit, you win a little bit. It's just that, that balance, that pull of the universe that does that, right? Huh. You're going to be happy that you call judgment because it changes the way that you feel. Yeah. See, five of cups. You're not disappointed. I mean, frustrated, bitter. This is more of the five representing the change of the cups with your emotions. Okay, so, I mean, with the win some, lose some, you definitely are okay with that because you know that's part of the game is to lose because you can't you know, always be a winner, I guess, right? Let's see. It was a tough decision. A tough decision with the Two of Swords, right? Definitely a tough decision, okay? So whatever you're investing in, I think that you're going to be okay because it's really looking like that. You had to make a tough decision. That's why you had to go in, analyze the situation as that hermit to get justice to... To yourself. Okay, this is to yourself, right? Look at you just pushing on, pushing on, pushing on, nine of wands. Yeah, you're just trucking through, right? You're like, I'm gonna just leave this decision behind me. I've already made up my mind, I'm just gonna do it. You know, because I know that it's gonna pay more in the long run, then I'm going to lose right now. <coughs> yeah, so now you have, like, the whole world in front of you, right? Now you're going to have, like, another decision. 
Another decision to make. Decisions, decisions, decisions. That's what it's all about right here. And it's definitely going to be something that you're going to fight for, okay? You're going to fight to the death for this decision. Because, I mean, since now you've cleared the way, there's a lot more open for you, right? Because you got this, this understanding, this recognition of, you know, win some and lose some. Because we all go through that. What is this Five of Swords? Oh, well, you know what the Five of Swords is. Yeah, Queen of Swords. Five of Swords, Queen of Swords. So when I said you're going to fight to keep this going at all costs, definitely you are going to cut off anything that doesn't make you happy because that Queen of Swords is directly underneath the Sun card, which says you're going to cut off things, people, and places that don't uh, make you happy, basically. or maybe going to frustrate you. Okay? Because you're going, you're going straight to the top. Queen of Pentacles, right? Yep. Anything that's not worth this investment, whatever that is to you, okay? It could be a relationship. It could be finances. It could be a lot of different things. But however that relates to you, that's what it's going to be. <clears throat> so you're definitely going to be focused on your finances because this is the first card of your story. So that tells me that's what's leaning on. Um your investment here right so maybe you're going to um put in a little bit of funds maybe kind of like a 401k so you might you know have to go without with something for now but the long-term investment of that investment is going to pay off and that's what you're steady focused on yeah you're definitely not going to let anything change your mind you're going straight for it Another decision. Two, two, two's out here. So two, two, two is very significant for y'all. Decisions, balances, uh, choices, right? So something... Uh, okay, so I think something's hanging in the balance here with this this final decision because the queen of pentacles her back is turned towards the two of pentacles so this is this decision hasn't been made yet because i think you're still in that cutting out process wheel of fortune yeah some good luck and good fortunes coming your way okay so definitely this is you know like i was saying about finances it's coming through pretty good so once you balance your Queen of Swords mode, get into your Queen of Pentacles mode, you know, then that cycle is, is going to change. Then you'll start seeing some good luck and some good fortune coming into you, okay? Wow, that's pretty clear cut, right? Okay, so that's kind of the story, my friends. Uh, let's get into your outcome and see how this is all going to really end for you. Looks pretty good so far. I told you, Ace of Wands. So there's a brand new opportunity coming for you that is that is definitely um, it's a like a creative project. So something maybe that you've always wanted to do is now going to uh, show itself as as an opportunity for you to um, jump on it jump on me right nice ace of wands that's your justice devil card oh snap okay this is kind of like a warning the warning is to not get too in that obsessive greedy like kind of mode and self-sabotage yourself because that's what really could happen so the devil's underneath the hermit two majors we have three majors out here right here so the devil underneath the hermit says be wise and and you know making this decision because what's coming into you is going to be huge and it could really get you into that like i said that self-sabotaging kind of greedy obsessed energy right you got to stay focused on cutting the things that don't make you happy out of your life to keep going. And that's what that coin there, that pentacle represents is like that sacrifice. All right, let's pull a couple more cards here.
Yeah, I like this for you. This is good. Temperance. So have balance, right? Get a little balance, get a little peace, get a little harmony, knowing that this gift is coming in for you, this opportunity, this chance, right? Stay balanced, my friends. It's going to work out really good. It's looking good so far. Yeah, see, Six of Pentacles. Ah, nice. This is an even give and take. This is more balanced. This is definitely, it's going to be like a push and pull kind of thing where, you know, you give a little, you get a little, you give a little, you get a little. That's the investment. So, my friends, short and sweet, but right to the point. That has been your reading. Mm, I enjoyed that one for y'all. Appreciate your time and your energy for coming on out here, right? So, check out my playlist. I got a bunch of good stuff going on, right? Um, tell your friends, any neighbors, all about my channel. Maybe uh, throw me a super thanks, donation, maybe even subscribe. But definitely hit the like button, right? But I wish you the rest of your week to be well. I hope that, you know, you're not too... Uh, if you're around where I'm at, it's hot, it's crazy. So try to keep yourself, you know, cool and safe, right? Because this heat can take you out real quick, you know what I mean? So drink your water, stay hydrated, find some shade, don't overexert yourself. You know what I mean? But other than that, get ready for your weekend. Enjoy it because a huge opportunity is coming for you, my friends. Jump all over it. Yeah, you got the idea of it, so run with it. Peace and prayer, my friends. And I will see you later. Thank you.